Ecuadorian indigenous uh, leader has been murdered at his home in Ecuador. He was against the oil companies uh, exploring for oil in, in his native uh, land, as part of the rainforest. And uh, they found that uh, he's, he has been killed in the morning by unknown uh, you know, assassins. And you don't know it, I don't know who has done it. But geologists in the past uh, have been notoriously famous to be associated with the uh, you know, uh, in colonial powers like British uh, Petroleum and uh, American, sh uh, you know, companies like Exxon Mobil and such things. And it's because of the sanctions they put on the Russian oil. Now they are going to explore oil in further areas. Ecuador is one of the oil-rich countries in the world. Is one of the founding o uh, members of the OPEC and OPEC Plus, which Russia is part of it also. And uh, now we have found that uh, in the rush for the oil, uh, this indigenous leader who was against the uh, pollution of his land, capture of his land by force, and just uh, passing it to the oil companies, have been murdered. Uh, nobody yet knows who has done this murder. British uh, media has not talked about it, but we know that there are some companies like Shell, which are British actually, and American companies. Geologists usually are associated with this. In British Empire, geologists were part of the army. They were called officers. They had ranks like the army, and they were kind of part of the Queen's, you know, in the Victorian times, part of the Queen's office. The authorities are searching for this uh, a solution to who has done it, uh, as you can see, they, are, they look very much like the American General Petrius. And uh, they're trying to investigate this further. I'm sure they will find somebody to introduce, or oh, maybe they will not find. Who knows? We have to wait and see. But geology can kill. Remember, next time when to, you are at a gas station, remember this man. And there have been a research in the UK that showed that uh, in Nature it was published that the geology and astronomy are among the most racist subjects in the UK. The practitioners are practically racist. And personally, I have heard in conferences and talks that how they love they think of the people, and especially indigenous non-whites.